get that job. She wants to keep it. And she's that's willing why, to put the nation and through an impeachment. That's why she continues that narrative. The president's people say. That this is not an impeachment. This right. is an inquiry. It is right now. And that's why the president's saying go after the substance. There's nothing there. And I think it's a, a joke that people think that if you have questions to a lieutenant colonel because he's a great war fighter, that you're somehow not patriotic or don't like the military, which was the blowback they were getting uh, from our show and others. I think that's farcical. Uh, there's no doubt about it. This lieutenant colonel was born in the Ukraine. He came here. Reportedly, the Ukrainian government reached out to him about Rudy Giuliani working as an envoy for the president. And to think that maybe he was going to come forward with an additional point of view and can't be challenged because he served in the military, it doesn't make any sense to me. All right. So um, we'll look at General Flynn. I mean, 33 years as a veteran. Yeah, they have no problem ridiculing what he did as a (laughs) lieutenant general. Uh, Meanwhile, Joe Biden yesterday, uh, Joe Biden yesterday uh, came out and thought it would be a great time to criticize the president for what he did over the weekend. And that was give an order to take out the world's most wanted man. Look at how he breaks down what the president did wrong in trumpeting that victory. Whether it was Baghdadi 